Hey everyone, Lainey here. So as you know, I'm transitioning host, so that means our episodes are delayed again. I hate it just as much as you do, but I wanted to give some quick updates in the hopes that this reaches you, my very awesome and amazing subscribers, and I didn't want to clog the episode with all of these updates, so I'm just going to release a little update episode in the hopes that you listen all the way through and let me know if I'm going to see you at any of these events. So the first is the True Crime Podcast Festival happening July 12th through the 14th, 2024 in Denver, Colorado. You can use code Laney to save on your standard tickets and VIP tickets, but we also have virtual tickets available and we have day passes available. So if you're in the area and want to make the trip out, we are going to have so much fun. It's going to be so great. And I honestly would love if some of my listeners came out. It's been so long since I've seen you guys in person, since I've met you. And I want to feel reconnected with my audience. And sometimes this is the way to do it by doing meetups and going to festivals, etc. So I really hope to see you there and also to engage with you more on social media. So head over to Instagram, Twitter, or on TikTok, anywhere, True Crime Cases with Lainey. I'm also going to be at the Berkshire Podcast Festival. And I was there last year. It was incredible. I am so excited. So this October, I'll be meeting up with some of my favorite podcasts for peak fall foliage in beautiful Berkshire County, Massachusetts, and I want you to join me. I'll be live at the Berkshire Podcast Festival October 19th in North Adams, Massachusetts for an incredible podcast event and live show featuring tons of podcasts, including Justin from Generation Y, Lucy from Wine and Crime, Robin from The Trail Went Cold, and Charlie from Crime Lines. There's just so many wonderful shows. I cannot wait. The Berkshires are conveniently located in western Massachusetts, which is just a quick trip from Albany, Boston, New York, Montreal, and Philadelphia. So if you come, you can explore the world-class museums, the birthplace of farm-to-table dining, and the epicenter of the Gilded Age, and then soak up the sounds of some of your favorite podcasts for this weekend-long event. I'm going to be on a panel. I am Joke beyond belief. To buy tickets, see who's coming, and learn more about the Berkshires, go to www.berkshirepodcastfestival.com. It's going to be amazing. And then my next event is happening in February slash March of 2025. And I already pre-recorded something, so here it is. I have some exciting news. I'm heading out on a trip with listeners and some other podcasters to South America. We are going to visit the vineyards in Chile and Argentina, talk about true crime as we cross the Andes together and explore the cities of Santiago, Valparaiso, and Mendoza. We have a private local tour guide for our group and Josh from True Crime Bullshit and Charlie from Crime Lines are coming so we already have three podcasters who are absolutely ready to hang out, talk about cases, or even give tips on starting a podcast if that's what you're interested in. I have a link in my description box to see the details of the trips as well as options to pay for it. As I'm recording this, we really only have, I think, two spots left. We've worked the numbers to keep the price as low as possible while making sure everyone in the places we go to, like our tour guide, get paid a fair amount. That said, I know it can be a lot to lay out $3,500 at once for a trip like this, so you can reserve your spot with just 25% down and then pay up to like 90 days before the trip. Or they offer other financing options through a firm to make it even easier to afford month over month. And all those details are at the website. Josh, Charlie, and I worked with our trip coordinator to be sure we offered a unique and memorable trip. And trust me, this is not a money grab. We have planned sessions to discuss cases and even go over case files. Once everyone is signed up, we'll reach out and perhaps add more sessions like how to start a podcast if people are interested in that. Primarily, though, this is a vacation with friends and soon-to-be friends. We have a cap on how many people can come so that we keep it an intimate experience. There is going to be history, culture, camaraderie, incredible views, food, wine, and just so much more. I'm so excited. And if you're traveling solo, so am I. My husband isn't coming, so don't worry if you have no one to travel with. I'm going to be there for you. I promise. Once we get there, we're going to all be in one group, so you'll be totally fine. Check out my social media or the link in the show notes for more information to get booked for this incredible adventure. See you there. Okay, so that's the end of this episode. And a quick reminder, I appreciate and love every single one of you who listens and rates and reviews and shares the podcast. It truly is how we grow. So if you're on any social media platform and you happen to be listening to an episode, go ahead, 
share what you're listening to, feel free to tag me. It makes me so excited. I don't think you guys understand how much it means to me uh, to know that people out there are listening. Sure, I can look at the download numbers, but I really like seeing and following people on social media to go like, wow, you're one of my listeners. I think that's so cool. Anyways, I'm getting all sappy. I hope you guys have a great rest of the week and the next episode is on its way. I thank you again from the bottom of my heart. Bye.